Hey guys, welcome back to the Planner Pixie Co. Show. We are doing our very last same but different week from the Facebook group. Um, kind of bittersweet, but it's on to bigger and better things next year, right? So the kit that won out for December is called Christmas Village. So of course we're going to be doing some memory planning from December 14th through the 20th. Here is the kit. It's so just, it just screams Christmas, right? This is the only kit that I'm using for December this year that actually is traditional Christmas colors. I'm I'm doing non-traditional for Christmas week because I just feel like this year has been non-traditional, so why not? But very happy to be using at least one kit <laughs> that is red and green. Um, so pretty. And this scene right here reminds me so much of Pigeon Forge um, here in Tennessee. If you've ever been there, then you know the Christmas place. I don't know why. It just, that just reminds me of that place so much. So I do have the whole kit pulled and um, I'm using several different colors. I am going to be mixing red, glitter, green, and I do have some um, of the shattered glass pulled too. <laughs> This might not come together very nicely, but I think it's going to. I think it's going to be fine. I think it's going to be beautiful. I mean, there's red and green and there's snow, so I think it's going to be all right. So these are some um, fun new underlays from my shop as well as the matching washi overlays. I do have some scripts, several different kinds of frames. I do have the chunkier glitter header overlays and um let's get to putting this down and see <laughs> see what all this craziness looks like together may notice some things are different. <laughs> Call me a lunatic, but I replaced all the underlays. <laughs> when I got done with it, it was just too much. I'm not a huge fan of red, so it was just too much red for me, and I didn't like it. So I wanted to bring in some more of the shattered glass, and I like the way that looks so much better. <laughs> I did change this out too, and I changed this overlay as well, so whatever. It's fine. I didn't want to look at this spread and totally regret all of my choices, so I went ahead and changed it. So, this is the only, probably already said this, but again, I don't ever remember what I've said at the beginning because it took me so long to get back to filming. 
Um, this is the only like red green traditional Christmas kit I've used. So, um, it was just it's too much red. It was just too much red. Okay, so here we go. Randy's random question. Um, are you currently binging any kind of show? What it, or what is like your favorite show to binge if you're not like currently binging anything? Um, I am actually currently watching or binging. I kind of go back and like I will have a show to binge kind of in the background and then uh, some nights I'll watch a movie or two then go back to binging. So the show that I'm actually binging right now is Cougar Town. I'm actually almost done with it because they're only like 30 minute less than 30 minute episodes actually um so it's not took me very long to get through it but i think it's a really funny show and i really like courtney cox i miss friends so much friends is such another good show to be in dry i love friends and i love gilmore girls um i'm probably about to start gilmore girls again it's just such a good show but yeah so favorite show to binge and or are you binging anything right now and what are your thoughts on what you are binging all right so this was our same at different week i'm sure i've already said that very last one we're having for a while so just went ahead and put same but different and then my workout not worked out it's okay okay so our day by day um all right I had to pick up groceries this day and that is crooked, ain't it? Oh my goodness, okay. So I had ordered the day before and this was a Kroger pickup. Normally, I will go to Walmart too and get things that are missing from my order, but I did not this day. I just straight up went to Kroger. I didn't really feel like stopping at Walmart. Uh, after let's see I went to Walmart this next Saturday so I was wishing when I did that that I had just went ahead and went Monday but I didn't um and then while I was out I did a PO drop I do have one of these cute little stampies I feel I'm about to run out of stampies to use for um these spreads you guys and I'm kind of sad about it so this one is from do I want to put it down here no this one is from stick with the plan co and it fit very well where is my script okay po drop and then I came home and packaged some orders this one is also stick with the plan co if I'm remembering correctly I used a lot of stick with the plan co in this spread because her Christmas characters are just they're perfect they're all the right colors and there's just so many that fit perfectly in this spread so then I filmed it says SBD which means same but different so I filmed the intro and the base to this spread because I had to get a picture took for and I was late with it too I think I didn't even post it until Tuesday if I'm remembering correctly um I always have to do it ahead of time to post a picture this is a cute little camera from happy Daya. Why do I always have hairs stuck to <laughs> my stickers? So this day it says that I was in my feelings um, and I ugly cried. I don't know why. I don't know why. Who knows? <laughs> this is like from I think the holiday burnout sheet from uh, Once More With Love. So I thought it looked probably like how I felt that day. And then I just did some design work the rest of the night. And that's a cute little reindeer on a computer from Coffee Monsters Co. Okay, so I, this is another thing that I'm going to try really hard to work on in 2021 is just my attitude. I feel like I just have a really bad attitude a lot of times. And like I'm just, I'm such a negative thinker always thinking something is going to happen bad and um, I've just got to get out of that way of thinking and I 
feel like a lot of what has been bothering me these past few weeks is just stuff I'm worrying about that I cannot control. Just me having negative thoughts about things and it's just I've got to start changing my attitude and I feel like you can totally change your day if you just think in the right positive way. I really feel that because I've been thinking so negatively lately and it's really been causing me to have a hard time. So definitely another thing I'm working on in 2021. So I just had a pretty much design and chill day. This is one of the weeks that um, this was not last week. It was the week before. This is this kind of started our like very chill, slower paced couple of weeks here. Um, let me find an arrow. So we had gotten all of the um, Black Friday orders done, and then I think I actually skipped a week on releases. So slowed down quite a bit. That is from Pumpkin Paper Co. I really really love the candy cane design. <laughs> And then I just had a YouTube binge this day as well. It like took me no time to pull characters and stuff for this spread because it was just such a slow week <laughs> that there wasn't much to pull. Um, so this is from a Paper Shire YouTube binge. And then this <laughs> was one of the weeks too that I just kind of ate myself to death and gained a lot of weight. <laughs> so this night I had um, some noodles. I put Parmesan noodles that is from Paper and Thread and I think that's supposed to, like, supposed to be mostly like ramen noodles but it works. So if you've never had just straight up spaghetti noodles with butter and Parmesan, oh my gosh it's so good. It's one of my favorite really bad naughty things to eat. Um, and so I had that this night and then um, we actually had a movie night this night. That doesn't happen very often. Um, so we watched the movie Freaky. And I really actually enjoyed it. Um, this is also Stick With A Plan Co. See, just so perfect. Little Christmas on the couch. We weren't on the couch. We were actually in bed. But so the movie Freaky, it was like, um, had Vince Vaughn in it. And I feel like it's been a minute since I've seen anything with Vince Vaughn in it. But... Um, it was kind of like the movie Freaky Friday where they switch positions, the mother and daughter, right? And then it kind of had like some aspects of Halloween, some aspects of like Friday the 13th type thing. Um, so he ended up switching bodies with a teenage girl and I just thought it was hilarious to see you know, Vince Vaughn's a big man. It was hilarious to see him acting like a teenage girl. So I quite enjoyed that movie. So if you haven't seen it, check it out. It's pretty good. So the next day I did a pick list. Um, and that is from Paper and Thread. And then I did do some printing. Normally it would take me all day to do invoices. The pick list I know I've said has been a game changer. I actually got invoices done in about an hour and ended up printing from the office as well which I don't normally do. I usually like will sit on the couch and print or go to bed and print and I got everything done. Look at me putting the same colors. Let's Let's do these backwards. We'll just do it like this. Um, so yeah, it has cut my time. I feel like more than in half, so that's pretty awesome. That is from Paper Shire. And then, so I have a PO drop on here. Pretty perfect little Santa with a package. This is once more with love for a P.O. drop. I know that's probably supposed to be like a Christmas present, but it works. So then, dang it guys, I am the world's worst at this, ain't I? I'm gonna have to change them. Dang it. How many, how many 
spreads have I done? How many on-camera spreads have I done this year that I have not had to rearrange character stickers because I just don't pay attention? <laughs> I don't know. A lot of them. A lot of them. So I'm going to go ahead and stick this over here where it needs to be. So we'll have one here and one here. Okay, so PO drop and then I'm gonna cut this one. This one is Oh Hello Michelle. I had noodles again this night, you guys. Like, what? Just enjoyed them so much the night before that I decided, why not? So I just put noodles here and then I did some plan with me prep, which was, what is this, Wednesday? Um, plan with me prep. Oh, this was just me picking out um, a couple of more kits, kits to plan ahead and deciding which foil I was going to use with which kits. That took a little bit of my time up. Okay, what did I do with that? It's over here. Okay, and that was my Wednesday. Okay, so for Thursday, uber boring day. Um, I had a full on design day and that was it. That's all I did. <laughs> all day long, just designed. Done told you I still haven't caught myself up. It's okay. So I'm going to do this a little differently than normal. Just to take up this space right here. So this little... Um, desk scene is from Sweet Beans Plans and I'm just going to put Design Day up here like this. I think that looks super cute. And then um, this night I had pancakes for dinner. <laughs> God. No wonder I have gained so much more weight. That is from Paper Shire. So I just put pancakes for dinner. Then, and then I binged some Ghost Whisper this night. Um, so I went from the couch to the bed. This is also Stick with a Plan Co. Probably meaning you're supposed to be watching Christmas movies, but that is not what I did. Alright, and then Friday. So we had new releases, so I just put publish sale and I think okay what day was this the 18th yeah this was a pretty good you liked these pretty good fairest um aurora and sunday morning was the releases this was a really good release and I had some new foil as well quite a bit of foil orders I had to do within these couple of weeks okay and then so Casey was cutting this day. <sighs> it's an awful lot of work. I swear it felt more chill than usual though. It's pretty crooked, ain't it? Mm -hmm. And there's another hair. Lord. Uh, I'm the worst about my hairs. Oh, that hair is like attached to the underlay. I lose hair like crazy. My husband finds them all over him all in the bed I want to cut my hair so bad but I've already told myself that I'm not going to do anything like that until I can lose some weight and have more energy because once I do cut my hair I'm going to have to fix it every day and I know me right now I'm lazy and I don't want to fix my hair every day so if I have a little bit more energy I might feel like fixing my hair on a daily basis. Um, okay, so he was cutting this day. That is from Fox and Cactus. I had some laundry to do. That is from Happy Daya. And so this day I made some sausage balls. Uh, I had originally thought we would give them away as like part of people's presents, but um, we ended up eating them all, <laughs> which is fun. They were so good. Uh, it's been years since I made sausage balls, so that is also Stick With The Plan Co. And then I just designed a lot this day again. Ask me how I've not gotten caught up on designing. I don't know. 
I will never ever know. So this is a cute little, um, would that be an emoji with a little Santa hat on from Coffee Monsters Co. And then I do believe that this knot was the um, Mask Singer finale. Um, were Leah and Rhymes one and then that is a icon from my shop and then let's see oh so this is the day I had wished I had went to Walmart on Monday because I went the Saturday before Christmas and uh, it was so packed it was so packed and this my friends is why Tennessee has been number one in COVID cases, people just, I don't know, people around here just don't care. So, <laughs> anyway, uh, that is, is that Coffee Monsters Co? Saturday, yeah, that's Coffee Monsters Co. So, um, used that with the mask, like the winter mask um, emoji to go in there because, you know, I am... One that is abiding by the mask wearing. But I was just so ready to get out of there. It was, it was like Black Friday shopping in there that day. And I was just like, ew. Ew, ew, ew. So, um, as I was leaving Walmart, um, I didn't get groceries or anything. I just had to pick up like a couple of cards. And I had to pick up some stuff to make peanut clusters it was just a few things so it wasn't like a grocery run so i stopped by mcdonald's and got us some food i got casey a mcrib and i got me some nuggets that is from fox and cactus that's quite literally what i look like driving um eating fries on the way home and then when i got home i put on a new set of nails and that is a printable from pink leaf printables and I just changed the color to match the spread and then I guess being around all the people exhausted me because <laughs> I came home and took a two hour nap and let's see let me get this right I'm gonna be over here and up here okay so um that is from Saturday that's from Coffee Monsters Co. I just feel like that's how I felt. So then when I woke up from my nap, I wrapped presents. You guys, I only had to rip, wrap presents twice this year. And both times it was like only three or four presents. That's how grinchy I was this year. A lot of people got money in gift cards. So we were going to my mother-in-law's house the next day. So I had to get all of the presents wrapped for what we were doing there. That is also Stick With A Plan Co. And then I decided to go ahead and make these peanut clusters. This is so cute. And I don't know if you can tell, but it has like little gingerbread man um, hiding behind its back. Um, this is from Once More Would Love. And it's just me baking it up in the kit. I wasn't really baking. So you just take... Um, I buy like one of the big things of, what are they called, party, are they party peanuts or something like that? I don't know, like one of the big tubs. And you take a whole thing of chocolate bark, almond, chocolate almond bark. And I have a double boiler. And so you put the water in it, let it um, boil, and then it has a thing that you put on top of the boiling water. You put all of your um chocolate in that and it melts and then you dump your peanuts in and then you just scoop them out in spoonfuls and like lay some parchment paper out on your count countertop and let them harden up and they're the best things ever also you could do it in the crock pot too but um it's faster if you do it with a double boiler that way you don't have to wait all day for it to melt um, okay, so on Sunday, and if you guys hadn't noticed, this is I'm doing this like I did last week with the um, the half box on these and just making them into one of the little squared off boxes. So we had a Christmas over at my mother-in-law's, like I said, um, 
this is stick with the plan go so i just put straighter christmas at 12 p.m and it was just me casey his mom her boyfriend and then my sister-in-law her husband and their two kids there wasn't very many of us so um i felt okay about being there and there not being a million people so we picked up pizza it's usually what we do over there we're the ones that bring the pizza and that is um once more with love so we had pizza and then again i was tired <laughs> Um, and so I just put tired AF and this is like, I feel like this is kind of like a little like, um, anxiety type bear or a headache bear, but it works, um, from Happy Daya. And then I had to work on my freebies for the TPC sale that is next week. And I'll go ahead and give you guys a spoiler alert. Actually... When is this video going to go live? I think I'm going to try to put this one up for Monday. So I guess this will be a spoiler alert. Um, or maybe it won't. Because I think... I don't even know when my takeover is. So maybe it won't be a spoiler alert. Just forget I even said that. <laughs> because by the time this posts, you might have already seen my freebies. But So the theme for this round is squad goals. And I had the hardest time deciding what to do. And I think I pretty much went in a totally different direction than everybody else. It seems like everybody else went with like friends or um, um, the Golden Girls. Like a lot of those kind of TV shows... Y'all liked that Winnie the Pooh Oh Bother kit so much that I went in the Winnie the Pooh direction. And so that's what my freebies are. They're like baby character, baby Winnie the Pooh, baby Tigger, baby Roo, baby um, Piglet. It's pastel. It's very Randy, very Planner Pixie Co. Um, and it's just super cute. So I can't wait for you guys to see those. But I did have to get my freebies done. That's Coffee Monsters Co. And then I did watch some more Ghost Whisper. That is Once More With Love. And that was week three of December. So I am much, much happier with the way I th this turned out than what it would have with all of that red. I would have hated it every time I looked at it. So I'm glad I changed everything. I think this bottom washi right here worked out so well. It just looks like sparkly snow. Mm, I love it so much. So there's another one in the books, you guys. I hope you enjoyed this. If you did, go ahead and gives it, gives it, gives it a thumbs up, please. And if you haven't already, please subscribe to my channel so you don't miss all the things. And I will talk to you guys in the next one. Bye.